video on the coronavirus, um, COVID-19. Um, I don't, I don't think I said it in any of my previous videos, but I am a nurse. Um, so I don't like to just give out information without having some sort of background. Um, so the other video, which I will leave a link up there was about, uh, positive vibes, words of encouragement, things to do in a quarantine. Um, I didn't add what I, I, I thought. I'm just thinking of stuff now. Um, so playing board games is also very fun and very retro. Um, we actually played Monopoly last weekend and it is a long game. So that's also fun. So with COVID-19, um, the whole premise of why this virus is spreading very rapidly. I mean, everybody can check the CDC website. You can also Google um, coronavirus. You can Google SARS. You can Google, and SARS is S-A-R-S, or MERS, M-E-R-S, which have also been viruses that um, we've had in the past, such as H1N1 as well. Um, just to see like how they handled it then and how we're handling it now, um, the different types of isolation um, and sorry. No. No. Because uh, there's been some pandemics in the past and we've dealt with them differently considering they are different viruses um, and I don't want people to get freaked out but the whole point of isolation and staying at home because most states will now just issue a stay at home order um, because this is really getting out of control. Um, so hand washing is number one. Wash your hands 15,000 times a day if you have to. Soap and water, hot water is preferable, but any amount of friction for 20 seconds, I'm sure by now everybody has heard about washing their hands. Um, it is the number one prevention of contact. I mean, your hands, they go everywhere. If you think about all the things that you touch, your face, uh, your eyes, especially, um, showering if you do have to go out I know a lot of doctors nurses pharmacists um, they do actually do have to go out and treat people um, so if you do have to go out it's best to just come in take all your clothes put them in a bag take a, a nice hot shower scrub all the parts your face everything that could have a potentially been contaminated and laundering those clothes as frequently as possible and the staying home is is key because sorry working right with with the kids at home um, staying home is important because the longer we go out and go shopping and start walking around start collecting in groups the longer we have to do this quarantine and isolation so everybody wants it to be over quickly and that is the best way I mean there are tons of things as I said in my previous video that we can all do at home um, it sucks but um, there are things that we can be doing and that is one of them um, staying home um, cleaning um, people are interested in how to disinfect uh, if you can't find Lysol um, there are substitutes. Bleach is a great virus killer. Um, and you can um, just wipe everything down. Doorknobs, handles, um, anything that are high frequency surface contacts that you touch or come in contact all the time. Um, and that Clorox or bleach uh, is a disinfectant by itself. You just have to be careful not mixing it with other cleaning products so that you don't cause inhalation of uh, 
toxic substances. But, um, and I heard something that was like really appropriate uh, from doctors in New York that were saying that you just have to pretend like you have the virus yourself. And what would you do if you had the virus? You certainly would not be going shopping. You wouldn't be um, talking to a large group of people. You wouldn't want to get your family members sick. Um, so if we just all pretend that we have it and for the next two to three weeks stay home, oh, bless you, then hopefully this whole thing will be over. Um, so this was just a quick video on COVID-19. It is a SARS type virus. Like I said, you can um, Google or uh, look it up on the internet um, for what SARS is. Um, and the actual coronavirus is just the name that it makes a corona or crown shape um, on a microscope. So um, any questions, comment down below, like, subscribe, share with your friends. Um, I'm going to try to do some more videos that are about positive um, thoughts, energy, um, consuming ideas that, you know, can get us off this track of, um, you know, negative uh, reporting and death and all that nobody wants to hear on a daily basis. So um, I'll keep them coming as much as I can make them. It, uh, it's it's very overwhelming, I'm sure, for a lot of people with uh, the kids being home from school and juggling all that stuff. So um, get out some board games, <laughs> start playing Uno, um, teach your kids how to play um, blackjack or something. It, it, I mean, you can incorporate a lot of things with learning and spending time together. And of course, separate yourself when, when you think it is overwhelming. Like this guy, he's, he's getting totally frustrated with even my five minute videos. You want to say, say bye to the camera? Want to say bye? Say bye to the camera. Bye camera. Okay guys, hope you're well. See you soon.